The U.S. government has been under much scrutiny lately because of the possible illegality in the seizure of AP records. But how does the seizure impact future journalists? Depending on the outcome, it does have that element of a chilling effect. Weissenant said the chilling effect is when a source will not expose what they know due to fear of legal ramification, potential fallout, employment issues, or any other concern they would have. Suddenly a source is, you know, not only reluctant, sim but simply will not uh, give information to a journalist um, that otherwise would be able to report that information, information that can be helpful to society, helpful in, in preventing, you know, misuse, preventing government uh, indiscretions or preventing abuse of power, various things like that. AP's CEO, Gary Pruitt, had the same thing to say on Face the Nation. I think that it will hurt journalism. In fact, we're already seeing some impact. Already, officials that would normally talk to us and people we talk to in the normal course of news gathering are already saying to us that they're a little reluctant to talk to us. They fear that they, they will be monitored by the government. Pruitt left his address with a frightful ideology and warning. And if they restrict that news gathering apparatus, you're right. The people of the United States will only know what the government wants them to know. This reluctancy will prove to be an issue for future journalists to come. Reporting from the University of Utah, I'm Lauren Dean.